hello guys welcome back to today's video so in today's video we are going to do a deep cleaning of my living room since i enter into this house i've never done a deep cleaning you can see the how my curtains are really pathetic guys you can see i don't have i only have sheer over here and <laughs> i'm using this cloth as a, a curtain and also you can see my window guys it's really not looking nice and also my house is really dirty so we are going to do a deep cleaning you can see how it really looks like it's really 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 dirty so guys let's do the video so what i'm going to do i'm going to do a diy of this door of my door and uh, the window you can see how my curtains are really lagging so I'm going to fix that. I'm going to do a DIY over there and also the door. So let's start the video guys. And please if you are new here feel welcome to the family. If you are a returning subscriber thank you so much and I really love you. So don't forget to subscribe and also like the video. So let's start our cleaning. So the first thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to wipe off my carpet and I'm using the multi-purpose soap that I do make at home. And also I'm going to use the Ariel and lavender. I really like the smell of lavender guys. It really smells really nice. So I'm going to wipe off my carpet and let it dry outside as I continue my cleaning guys.
I'm going to take this table to my bedroom. I really still don't know what to do with it for now, but I will figure it out later because it really was taking a lot of space in my living room. I'm now wiping off the dust from my table and really this year I'm manifesting a bigger table because this one is really kind of tiny guys. So this year maybe God willing I will get a bigger table and also I was feeling bored so I thought of maybe watching a movie while I clean my room. I forget to wipe this my entryway carpet and now I'm going to do it really quick and let it also dry outside. Just have a look how my room was really dirty guys. I wonder how I was <laughs> staying in this house because with all these dirt guys, well, there are really a lot and yeah, I'm just ashamed of myself guys because it really take me a long to clean it. And now I'm going to wipe off my seats. I'm also using the same water that I use wiping off my carpet that is multi-purpose liquid soap and uh, aerial and also the lavender downy guys
now i'm going to remove my curtain and my shear this <laughs> this my so called curtain really served me because i've been using it for some time now and now it's it's time to go as i'm going to do a diy on this door and also i'm going to replace it with another curtain guys Now we are going to do a simple DIY on this door guys. Just I'm going to measure the length of my my door. So this length I'm going to measure it and then I'm going to transfer the measurement to the road that I'm going to use to make a road for my my curtains. So I'm going what I'm doing I'm just measuring the length. I transferred it to the road. I'm going and I'm going to cut it. Now this is what we call the strength of a woman because I really suffered cutting this road guys really really suffered and at long last I managed to cut it so what I'm going to do after this I'm going to transfer this road because this road is what we I'm going to use as a cutting rod in my door so after cutting it I'm going to put it on my door as a curtain rod guys now look at what i'm doing i'm just measuring just seeing if it really fits and it really fits really nice guys so what i'm going to do next just to install my curtain and boom we have our curtain rod guys and now our door will be looking really nice so the same procedure we are going to use also on our window guys doing just the same thing that we did on our door
now it was time to install my curtains guys and these curtains are not new they are old stock the dead stock from my curtain store by the way i have a curtain store and i will be linking the business page on my next video so support me there also and i'm selling the thrifted curtains and shears so if you might be interested in buying one you can dm me and guys i think that's all on this curtain they are not new they are thrifted and these are my dead stock from my curtain store guys and just wait you will see the difference that this curtain rod did to my curtains guys to my window they really look very nice guys leave a comment and tell me how they turn how my diy curtain rod turn out guys you can try this also at your home it's really affordable and budget friendly guys this the rod that i used i got it from outside And now my floor is dry, so I'm now taking back my carpet. And guys, advise me here, guys. I'm thinking of dyeing this carpet all black because this red is not just giving me a vibe. So I have been looking for a black dye and I'm not getting any, any around where I'm staying. So I was thinking of using a hair dye, the black hair dye. And I don't know how it will turn out. So advise me guys, should I dye it or just leave it the way it is? Because for me, it's not just giving me a vibe. And also, um, I'm not sure how the hair dye will turn out. But I don't know, maybe I will try out and let you know. But for the start, you can advise me on what to do here. So just leave a comment. I will read it and see how you guys think about it. Now I'm just wiping off my the dust from my mirror and I'm also manifesting an arched mirror, that big arched mirror. This year I don't know if I will get one. So guys, that's everything about my living room and it really turns out very nice, guys. So make sure you like the video and if you are a new subscriber, thank you so much for supporting me and don't forget to always like and turn the notification bell so that you may be notified anytime I upload a video. So that's everything and to my two Ottomans, that's the DIY project that I did. Those two white Ottomans are the DIY project that i did so thank you so much for watching and please kindly don't forget to like the video and share it with your friends and family thank you so much till we meet next time bye i love you